Here's the answer for day three, problem one. Use the figure below to find the unknown angle marked with the question mark. So we're looking for how many degrees this acute angle is in the top triangle. We have a few angle measurements to work with. In the bottom triangle, we know two of the three angles. And that will allow us to find the third angle because all three angles of a triangle add to 180. So 20 plus 40 is already 60. That means this angle is 120 because 120 plus 60 is 180. The angle right here is a vertical angle with the 120, and so it's also 120 because vertical angles are congruent. Now we know two angles in the top triangle, which will allow us to get the missing angle. Remember, all three angles of a triangle add to 180. So 120 and 39 is already 159. So 159 plus the question mark equals 180. Subtract 159 from both sides, and we find out that the question mark angle is 21 degrees. Now day three, problem two. The figure is a parallelogram. That means it's a four-sided shape and opposite sides are parallel to each other. We learned theorems about parallelograms in the first semester. One of them was the relationship of same side interior angles. That is, this acute angle and this obtuse angle. They always add to 180. If this one is 70, then this one must be 110 degrees.